morning, everybody. I know it's been a long time. I know I always say that. Uh, a lot of cool stuff has happened since I last talked to you. Um, <clears throat> I'll just get right to it. I got married. I married this girl here. That's my honey, Michelle Gates. She's Michelle Trout now because we're married. Wow. Um, we had the awesomest ceremony ever. Ever. Uh, we... God, what, how can I, I don't even know. I've mentioned before how much I love this woman. And she's pretty great. Um, with regards to the marriage specifically, bachelor party was awesome. Um, can't go into too much detail on that, but let's just say multiple places were... <clears throat> frequented, and everybody was happy in the bachelor and bachelorette party. And eventually the bachelor and bachelorette parties met up and said hi, and everything went great. Um, the wedding itself was amazing. We went, we had the service at my old church, which is the church that is somewhat responsible for me meeting Michelle, and is also the church that I went to as a child with my mother. So it was really special that we got to go there. Our reverend, who we love, Reverend Susan, performed the ceremony itself. And then we had speakers. We had my friend Tiffany and Kim St. Clair do readings, which were lovely. Dang near everyone I know and care about showed up for my wedding to the woman I love. And it's one of those rare things where reality actually meets up with expectation. It was literally the happiest day of my life. And it's supposed to be. But normally, you know, from other people I've talked to, the happiest day of their life, it was all right. It was pretty good. But no, no, this was like, like the happiest day of my life. Like I've never experienced that level of happiness from anything, anything. Um, I was also very happy because my honey was gorgeous, gorgeous. I was pretty darn uh, fine looking myself in my tuxedo. <laughs> Oh, that's the ring right there. Check that bad boy out. Oh, yeah. Wicked awesome. Manly, too. I'm very proud of my ring. Uh, I'm most proud. Well, no, I don't know if I should say most proud. Everything went great. Um, and we had friends and family helping us with everything from makeup to the music. We had uh, our friend who is our former KJ uh, signed the marriage license and... Our, another former KJ actually was the DJ for the wedding, and we had friends doing the flowers, and we had family cooking, and friends picking things up and driving people, and oh my gosh. I got to walk down the aisle to the Zelda Overworld theme. That's something I never thought I would actually get to do. I married the right woman, because when, I, when we were trying to think of music for her to walk down the aisle to, I said, hey... How about this? And it was uh, Zelda's Lullaby. And she loved it. That's, yeah, you marry the girl. When, when you say, hey, why don't you walk down the aisle to video game music? And she goes, oh, I love it. So yeah, I got to walk down to the overworld theme. She got to walk down to Zelda's Lullaby. And then we both got to dance back down the aisle, our recessional, to Another One Bites the Dust. Uh, and then we did karaoke at the reception, and there was so much food. Oh my gosh, our cake was beautiful. Her mom baked the cake. My groomsman's cake turned out to be the Hylian Shield. I did not know about that, but I was plenty happy to see it happen. Um, and then we went to Jamaica for a week. <clears throat> That's right. We took a round trip to Jamaica. Inside joke for some folks. Um, and Sandals and a Grill in Jamaica is just about the greatest place ever invented. Kings Bay is a lovely part of the world. Uh, Jamaica is a lovely part of the world. And then Kings Bay has these wonderfully gentle waves coming in, and Negril is absolutely gorgeous. And Sandals was amazing. I've never met so many genuinely friendly people. And I mean, I know it's their job to be friendly, but you can tell the difference when, between someone who is forcing themselves to be nice and someone who is honestly happy, you know, or at least happy to see you. And these people were great. We did 
We did limbo contests. We went snorkeling three times. I got sunburned. It rained every day. But that's okay. <clears throat> I'm from Phoenix. I love the rain. Because we also had sunshine every day. Cool thing about the tropics. It rains. It's sunny. It rains. It's sunny. It goes back and forth. Um, wow. It was such a good time. <sighs> got, I actually got video from there, too. So I'm going to be doing that as well throwing that up online as soon as my honey approves of it. Um, but this has already gone over five minutes, and I said I'm not going to make these things more than five minutes on the, anymore. So, uh, yeah, I am now a mister. I have a missus. And we are Mr. and Mrs. Trout, and it's uh, it's pretty great. I'm, uh, I'm pretty, pretty stoked about it. No, I'm never going to use that word again. Pretty happy. I'm elated. It's great. All right, so no more, no more happy videos. Uh, I'm going to edit this in the new one.